Howdy, y'all. Joe Hills here. Whoa! Seriously? Okay. According as I was doing, Nashville, Tennessee, and I need to rebuild my house. Time skip. As I was saying, I've established a new base here near the entrance to the second dungeon in hopes of being able to more quickly slay whatever beasts may lay in wait for me today in this dungeon. Let's pour some water here, just kind of see what's around. Okay, I hear blazes. Now, blazes are going to get hurt by water, but I don't want to pour water. Ooh. Okay, so this appears to be a just straight drop. Or I can drop to there. Okay, well, let's drop that down to there. And see what we can see. Of course, I'm going to be darkening this horribly if I'm not careful. So let's just make sure we have enough lights through here. Yeah, I hear blazes phasing in and out. What does this sign say? Escape kit. Excellent. I might need that later to build a ladder that'll, you know, actually let me escape this place. In fact, I should probably build that now. So let's just... Dang it! No, not again! I'm just O for losing on this one. I cannot get these creepers to give me any slack. And I hear blazes spawning, too. I wonder if they're behind that curtain there. They certainly sound to be. I hear a lot of mobs. I didn't bring a pick. Well, thank goodness they, uh, B-Ran put some in that chest. How could I leave the house without a pick? I was so distressed by that creeper that I just did not properly equip myself for this adventure. Hopefully this will not be my downfall. Hopefully my downfall will be far funnier. No, like that! Okay. So, getting out of here is gonna be a problem. I can tell you that much. Let's see, what would be the best way to resolve this? I don't think that it'll fall through that ladder there. Whoa, that was weird. Okay. Well, so that's a start. Whoa! I don't know what that was. I hear like a million mobs spawning somewhere, but I can't see them. I'm really curious if they're on the other side of this curtain, but what's the best way to find out? Probably something like this. Nope, that was a source block. Dang. Hmm. Well, let's just descend again and see what we can figure out. We're gonna need all the torches we can get throughout here just to discourage the future spawning of such creepers as may end my life. And we're just going to need to sort all the zombies out. You know, I'm so glad that I'm not Noah of biblical fame. Because if I had to get two of each of these creatures to put on an orc, I'd just be pulling my hair out. I'd be like, the skeletons are shooting at me, the creepers are exploding at me. Yeah, there's one now. You're not coming on my orc. I'm not a good enough guy. I'm, I'm just going to be like, nope, no creepers. Not today. Not on my orc. If I was like, uh, one of them, uh, dang it. Okay, so let's add a light there. Add a light there. Okay, it seems like there's definitely something down that way. Let's go ahead and store the water for right now. And I immediately realize how that I should get the lava up there. Dang it. Stupid advanced pathfinding. Stop being so advanced. I'm going to use the bucket to grab some of those source blocks after I break the glass. That's my solution. Like, can I remove these? No, those are not source blocks. Dang it. But if I come up here... Are these source blocks somewhere up there? Dang it, how did you get up here? That's remarkable. You can use ladders. Dang it. Okay. Where was I? I'm gonna try and scoop out some of the lava from in there. Dang it, no, it's too empty. And of course, now that's gonna try and come this way. Either way, I got lava. Let's go ahead and use it to free up some of 
this area down here in terms of lighting and darkness and everything. In a lot of ways, light is a currency in this game. It provides, you know, value where there was otherwise skeletons and a notable lack of value. Anything around here? Let's just add, whoops, add some light. Nothing up in the ceiling that I'm missing. Yeah, it's dark, but nothing too big. Meantime, that lava over here should have begun. Begun. Begatted. And the lava begat the light, which would begat the value. Buh -buh. I'm, I'm stuttering. Buh -buh. I don't know why I did that. See, normally I start my videos before I record by doing like a bunch of like unique New York and how now brown cow and you know all those other vocal exercises but for this episode I was kind of in a hurry and I guess I was cutting a few corners corners that were never intended to be cut I should have known I got cocky I should have never had so much hubris as to assume that I could dang it skeleton stop shooting at me for a minute I gotta regenerate some health and then shoot at you that's right. I'm gonna shoot at you now. How do you like it? Not much. Oh, that's an Enderman. Let's not go anger him. That would not be helpful to anyone. Meantime, let's go ahead and let some light in over here. And up there. Just generally discourage spawning. We've got this huge clear lava thing in the middle here. Which is super bright, not surprisingly. I think I hear blazes. Hey, hit the creeper. Whoa! Okay, out of, out of bows. Out of bows. What do you call those bow buttons? Bow arrows. And luckily I have this iron sword. I did a whole bunch of mining off camera in order to, you know, accumulate such things as I might need to continue my adventuring days. Whoa! Be gone. Okay, wait. It seems like I don't want this glass to break here. Whoa. Let's just add some light here. Discourage spawning. Back off. It seems like there's a whole cave back there, though, that we are going to want to explore. Whoa. So is that lava all going to hit me now? Whoa, that's a big pit. Dang it. Come on, guys. Come on. Work with me here. Work with me here, fellas. Why you all gotta be horrible forever? Nobody needs that. I just wanna see what's down here. And you guys are just like an endless parade of idiots that wanna smack me with their bodies. Well, prepare to be smacked with the sword of, you know, importance. Do I have any arrows yet? Good. You're dead. And did I just look at the Enderman? No, thank goodness. So we're gonna add some light a little bit further out here to discourage future spawning. There's like five creepers back there. How is that fair? One of you guys should get shot by that skelly. Seriously, get shot by the skeleton, guys. Here we go. Okay, good. So let's see what we can make of this down here. Seems to be some sort of lava pit. Yeah, you're an idiot. Get, go away. Dang it. You know I don't want to hang out with you, creeper. Okay, I keep your blazes, which are nat not naturally spawning. They're coming from somewhere. Probably down there. Let's just go ahead and... Try and check out what's over this way without getting knocked around by a bunch of stupid zombies. Okay, there's a zombie spawner. Or a skeleton spawner. Huh, that's interesting. There seems to be some sort of structure inside of there. I wonder if that's the fleecy box. This would almost be too easy if so. Huh. Although getting a good angle on it is proven difficult. I can't really see it too well from here. No, that's a stairwell. Let's see, what happens if I go up this stairwell? Where does this take me? 
And this is completely dizzying. Whoa, hello. And of course I'm almost out of iron sword. Is this where all the blazes are? I hear many of them. How did you get up here? Did you just follow me? Dang it, stupid pathing is getting too good. And my sword is gone. Okay, I might need to beat a he hasty retreat, get a new sword, get more food, and get some additional torches. But I shall return. Okay, so there's a few of them over there. I don't know if they've seen me. Yeah, he's seen me. Okay, that was almost a lot worse than it needed to be. Let's quickly run in here and run up the stairs, as we did last time. Okay, now I'm in spawning range, so I don't want to be there, but let's... Okay, shoot each other, guys. Really? No? No one's gonna shoot each other? You guys really need to hate each other more. If I had one wish, that would be it. That the skeletons hated each other more. Any sign of anything of significance in these caves back here? Whoa! Okay, I've got this sword of smart, and that should be helpful against the undeads. Not against him. Okay, there's a legit blaze over there. Not too keen a fan of him. And, wow, that's a lot of other creatures, too. Uh, I don't want those creepers to blow me up while I'm in this thing. So I should probably get out of this thing before they blow me up. I think that, that is the solidest of plans in relation to this tower. Ah! ah! Uh-oh. Oh! Okay. So that was bad. Let's go find out how bad. Okay, yeah, it is full of lava now. So that might be a problem. Dang it. So this is a skeleton spawner. This cave seems to continue all the way around here. I'm just kind of running blind because I've got nothing on me anyway, so there's no incentive to be careful. There's definitely some light up there. Let's see, is that the fleecy box maybe? Whoa, and blazes are now setting me on fire. Nope, no signs. That might not be the fleecy box necessarily. Might just be another one of them stairwells. Although there is a ladder there. I keep hearing all these blazes through here and I want to know where they are. Being as I've completely ruined that stairwell thing in that other place, there's got to be something, you know, that I can do to short circuit that. That stairwell seemed to lead upward, and here we are. Whoa! In the water, in the water. And of course all the blazes are immediately ruining everything. Whoa, and they're starting to get smart at me which I will not abide. Wow, that's a really tall thing. So this might actually be the top up here. This might be where that exits to. In which case, what I need to do is dump this lava somewhere that I will not need it. And let's get that water and mess some blazes up pretty good. How's that sound? Now, if I pour this water directly atop the blazes here, that will undo them a little bit, I think, anyway. See, so there's their spawner, and if they try and get to me, they're gonna, uh, you know, have to go through the water. Yeah, see? And now I'm on fire, which is not ideal. But we can light this up some through here. Wow, that's bad. Let's, uh, try and break this if we can. Okay, so that's gonna help some. Wow, I'm wearing a lot of armor right now, and... Dang it, okay. You are not welcome. None of you guys... Whoa! Okay, there was not a lot I could do there. Okay. Next problem. Everything about that was horrible. Okay, let's go back down there with minimal gear and see if we can find our way back into that uh, collection of wonderful, wonderful things I have. 
Whoa, I was gonna throw this, uh, regeneration potion at myself first. Let's hope that that helped a little. Um, maybe, maybe not. Yeah, we're not doing great here. Okay, so some of them are gonna knock into each other, into the flame, or into the water, but... Seems like on the whole that that's not a great place for me to be. Hmm. Let's see if we can kamikaze it and maybe lure the creatures away and then go back on another rush and actually grab all the equipment. I hear them shooting at each other. See, so yeah, they're, they're angry at each other. So if we go this way and creepers, yeah, blow each other up here away from my equipment. So maybe I can run back down there and grab that equipment. Maybe. Maybe. That's a big maybe. Or a little maybe that's just unlikely. Yeah, okay, see, I got my pants. It's a good start. If I can get off a of fire and into the wall here somehow. Into the wall. Into the wall. Five, four. Uh oh. Uh, blocks, blocks, blocks. No! I was very close to having an alcove to be able to establish a forward base there. Not actually, you know, doing it, but... There might be some time skipping here, I'm just gonna warn you guys. There's too much awesome iron equipment- Come in the water, idiot. Too much awesome iron equipment for me to just leave this all be. And... Scene. Well, that's a weird light and glitch. Let's see if I can now... Okay, I've got enough... I can equip this armor, which is a start. I've got a good sword and a good pick. I've got enough food. I think I'm in a good position to slowly start picking these guys off, one by one here. Which... Come on. There we go. How many are there left? Not a lot, I'll tell you that. Well, I'm on fire now, but I can fix that easily enough. Whoa. And... Let's see, where was my little alcove? Where is my alcove again? Was it here? Uh, uh, blocks, blocks, blocks. Okay, that's fine. We're just gonna armor ourselves slightly better. Excellent, we've recovered our torches, our bucket. Let's just kind of go along the wall, or into the wall a little bit, and come out along the side. I hear so many blaze spawners, though, maybe, or blazes, though. Maybe there's an additional spawner that I somehow missed, which would be distressing to me. Or beyond distressing. Okay, yeah, let's not come out right there. Lots of creatures don't like us right there. Let's come out somewhere else. Tunnel rat protocols, activate. So many blaze noises. 